this is Wes again. Today we're going to be going over the fuel injection system on a 92 F-150. It has the inline six. Um, I had a request for this video uh, yesterday, so I'm going to just go a quick overview. A few parts where they're located, some part numbers will be tossed up. Um, don't even go where you think you're going to get me to give you a Fram number because I don't like anything from Fram Industries. Uh, not even their air filters, fuel filters, oil filters, anything. But I'll give you plenty of other part numbers that way that you can kind of mix and match between, you know, Bosch, Motorcraft, any of those. Um, but overall, just want to start off. Obviously, you guys know where your fuel pump is. Uh, if you know anything about your truck, you know it's electric fuel pump. It's inside the tank, and the rear tank. Uh, mine has two tanks. Both has a fuel pump in it. Uh, you have your sending line comes out. And right about where the cabin door meets, go straight under, and on the inside of the frame rail, you will find your fuel filter. It has a kind of a hard to get to little access piece there, but uh, it's got two little nuts. Take the two nuts off, they're 10 millimeter bolts. Boom, just drop the whole thing, replace your fuel filter. You will need a special tool for that. I'll throw a link up for that too. Alrighty, I'm uh, going to go over a few things really quickly. Uh, this is your fuel pressure regulator. I'll toss up on the screen here in a second your pressures that you should be seeing at rest while it's running. Uh, it's actually kind of fairly high compared to the V8 versions. Uh, for whatever reason, the inline sixes had to have a little more pressure. But it's attached to your fuel rail which is this metallic rail that goes around and each cylinder has one injector which you can see is this part right here it has a two wire plug-in that goes to it that's what actually gives it the power to open and close and that, that harness actually goes up to the computer over here that I actually made a video a while back how to remove that um, as far as that goes, you can actually see one of the other injectors right there. You see it right there with the yellow, brownish looking plastic area. Injectors go by sizes, uh, how many pounds of fuel they can push through them per hour. Each color is representative of different pressure levels. Now, also, the main part of this video was to show where the fuel relief valve is. Uh, Raider valve it's on that rail 